Let f be the function defined by f of x equals negative 2x to the third. The function g of x is created by the following sequence of transformations, a vertical dilation by a factor of 2, then a horizontal translation, and then a vertical translation. So let's go in order. Step number one, a vertical dilation of the graph of f by a factor of 2, which means we are going to, so far, g of x is going to equal 2, times f of x. Vertical dilation has you multiply 2 to the entire thing. So, so far, what we get is 2 times f of x is 2 times negative 2x to the third, which is negative 4x to the third. Now, that's step one. Step two has us taking a horizontal translation three units right. When you take something and go three units to the right, you open up the parentheses for everything attached to x. And what you're going to do if you're going to the right, when you deal with horizontal translations, it's backwards land. So three to the right is not plus three. Three to the right is minus three. So x minus three cubed. Last but not least, and probably the easiest part, is we're going to take this guy and move it two units up. So all we do, all we do is just add two outside of the parentheses. So negative four, x minus three in parentheses, cubed, plus two happens to be c. So not a pleasant problem. I hate these personally, but hey, we got through it, and I had a great time.